you know, you mentioned Dick Wolf and, you know, uh, the color of change has said that like Dick Wolf shows ha are just basically cop propaganda and that they have really kind of, um, because of his shows, um, that we have these ideas about these cops that are heroes and that cops are somehow above the law and that they should be, their lives are more valuable than, than they're the people that they're supposed to protect and serve their lives are more valuable it seems and and we see all of that because of the way the laws are you know you know when a cop kills a, a black kid they they put them up there with their uniform on and but the, they talk about their side you know all their awards and things and the black kid is like you know going to be seen with a hoodie on and they're going to talk about he stole a candy bar when he was five years old and all that kind of stuff um but did when you when you were called to be a part of this, what, what did that concern you? That because the Dick Wolf world is so heavily, um, it glorifies the police um, departments across the country. Well, I mean, look, I think there are a couple of ways of looking at it. No, I didn't have those um, concerns because, like I said, my job as the artist is to go in and give um, um, whatever is the closest to truth. Um, you have a, no matter what show you're doing, just the mechanics of, of, of doing television shows, if you are doing a lawyer show, then in general, your, your cast, your main cast are going to be the heroes. If you're mm -hmm. doing a, you know, fire show, the, the firefighters are going to be, if you're doing a political show, the politicians, so people tune in to shows to watch um, basically to watch heroes. So I don't think that it's unnecessarily or, uh, you know, glorifying cops. I think, again, I think we, you have to, our, our cops um, cross some lines. I mean, I think, we, you know, we don't, I would have problems if, uh, if the depiction of our cops was that everything they do is perfect and clean. Um, our cops, break a lot of rules. And I think, I think, you know, the one unfair thing, and I'm not complaining because I'm proud of the show and, and, but it just, it seems like a lot of people a lot of times have opinions about the show, but they haven't really seen the show. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they haven't really, mm -hmm. because if you listen, we did, um, you know, a lot of these, we did the George Floyd story last year before George Floyd. Yeah. You know, we were, we, which is, we were doing which is that. devastating, we were showing that a white yeah. cop, you know what I mean? And, and showing that this guy was racist and, and had by, we, we did that before George mm -hmm. Floyd and mm -hmm. we did it, you know, a few years ago we did, you know, so, yeah. but I, I do think sometimes, unfortunately, um, I think people have a preconception of the quote unquote Dick Wolf world. And I, I mm -hmm. can't speak to Dick's other shows. Um, I have directed SVU um, a couple of episodes several years ago. Uh, but, you know, the show that I'm the executive producer on um, is a show that uh, we are committed to showing flaws in, in, uh, in our heroes. Um, we're show, you know, we're showing that they're not perfect. We're showing sometimes yeah. they cross crazy moral lines. Sometimes mm -hmm. they do things that and that becomes the show. So I think, you know, sometimes to have the healthiest conversation, it's just like, you know, we've got to, you know, it's not, the, it's, and that's also the other thing. The show's been on for eight years. I've been involved with it for three and a half years. Anyone that's been watching the show for the last eight years will tell you there's been a major shift in the show and the types of storytelling that we're doing once, uh, I came on board along with my boss, the head writer, Rick Ede. He and I have been partners um, on this journey, and it's been a dramatic shift for people yeah. that have seen the show, but if people kind of come with this preconception, oh, that's a Dick Wolf show, and it does this, it does that. You're like, mm -hmm. no, you're not looking at our show, and you're not yeah. you're certainly not looking at the show we've been doing for three and a half uh, years um, yeah. thus far. 